Hi folks, it's Mike Murphy, and today's quick tip is an Adobe Audition CC 2022. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to access the mixer view in the multi-track of Adobe Audition. If you want to go into the mixer view to make it easier for you to adjust things such as the volume, you can come up here and just click on the word mixer. If you do not see mixer next to the multi-track editor, just come up to the top menu, click on window and select mixer. And there's also a keyboard shortcut you'll see, option two on a Mac, alt two on PC. So I'm gonna go ahead and click on this mixer. The mixer view is just another way to view the multi-track editor. So if I went back to the editor, you see we have these options, ins and outputs. We have the effects, sends, EQ. If we go into the mixer, you will find all of those right here as well. In the mixer view, you will see the track names down at the bottom. If you change a track name here, let's just call this Mike Vocals. Hit enter return and go back into the editor. You will see it change it up here. And the same if you do here. Let's say intro music. Enter return, go back to the mixer view. And you'll see it updates there in the mixer. The master mix track is always at the bottom of your multi-track view in Adobe Audition. When you're in the mixer view, you'll find the master track over here isolated from the individual tracks. Wherever the current time indicator or playhead is, when you go into mixer view, that is where the playback is gonna start from. So I'm gonna press the space bar to preview this track. And then I'm just gonna use the slider control to get the volume the way I want it in the overall mix. So I'll press the space bar. <laughs> I can see right there with those two little red squares that this track is clipping. So I need to use a slider control to bring down the volume. I'm just gonna drag it. And I find that much easier using the slider than coming over here and using these little dial controls. And if you made a bunch of volume adjustments and you wanna bring them back to the zero mark, all you have to do is just double click and that will send them back to zero. Track effects that you have added while you're in the multi-track view. You can see here I added dynamics to this first track. If I go into the mixer view under the effects section, there's that dynamics. I can double click to edit it. I can also add additional effects while I'm in the mixer view. I can add EQ by just simply double clicking. There's also this option here for the read and write. So if I wanted to write some automation using the slider controls makes that very easy. And that is how to access the mixer view in the multi-track of Adobe Audition CC 2022. My name is Mike Murphy, cheers.